uh, other than the fact that I, uh, I've been in the situation that I am in, which is uh, without a place, just got a divorce. I was married for 22 years to a God-fearing realtor down in Ardmore, Oklahoma, and uh, had a blessed life. Found a way to screw it up, lost everything, moved here, and uh, now I'm um, trying to make ends meet, wrap my brain around where to start, how to start. Uh, of course, relying on, relying on the power up above to uh, guide me through this maze of, of uh, uncertainty. have to rely on other people, which is uh, something that's something that's extremely difficult for me. Uh, uh, being that I've, I've worked all my life, you know, there's boundaries in life, and there's rules and laws, and um, I got to I got to adhere to those those things if I want to if I want to live a, a productive life. Um, and not jeopardize my progress with foolish mistakes, uh, as I did. I'd like to know that, that uh, there's a lot of productive people in this city. Uh, there's a lot of people who, who are homeless, who, uh, who became homeless uh, for various reasons. And not to look down on this people. Give them a chance. There's uh, convicted felons in the city who perhaps were sent to prison for reasons that weren't true. Uh, or, or people who just want to do the right thing now. And uh, sometimes you just need a, a, a handout. Just need a handout, you know, uh, uh, and, uh, to, to get the ball rolling. Give people a chance. Don't, 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 don't be quick to judge a person by uh, their attire, or by their, their you know, uh, by their conversation. Uh, uh, I just, you know, once a person just, he tend to, he just take life for granted. And that's what I've done, you know, that shit. Took life for granted. And, uh, but it's gonna be all right.